Hey guys, I'm LB, and I like messing with this thing. It's really unusual how as soon as you start to move it cancels the teleportation. But uh, yeah, last episode we read this stuff in this terminal. And uh... Let's get started on these puzzles. Let's head over here first. A door too far. Hey, it's another friendly bot. Another one of those. Still don't know what these do. I think maybe... Maybe when he tells us that there's no harm in giving up, that's when we can use that, but I don't know. If they're a hint device, then I'm not gonna use them. go through the bars, I wonder? Why else would this be here? What is this? Oh, just a regular old jammer. This would let me get the laser in here, but... I could jam that guy. Oh, there's a box here. Let's go there first. Okay, why would we ever want to open this again? Oh wait, that's the way in here. That's... okay. So, we can use the box to block the back and forth dude. The question is, where would we want to box them in? How about there? That'll work, right? I think that might be an unintended solution. Or no, because we still have to get... something else there, yeah. So maybe it doesn't matter that we can do it that way. Because we can't... yeah, I can't see... that... All right, well... Let's figure something else out, then. There's windows in various places. So these can go through bars. That's good to know. Let us jam this thing. And where would be the best place to put this? Maybe here? Why 
Why can it not... It can go through some bars, but not others? Are you serious? It is clearly going between the bars. Okay. I guess I just can't go through bars at all, because I haven't yet to see it actually go through bars. That's, uh... Disappointing, to say the least. But... We could do that instead. Oops. Let's try that. a long time. I bet it's because it's for the bot there. Yeah, I bet it's for that guy. Why can it not see... Oh, because I... Duh. I had it connected to the wrong one. go. Okay. Next up, how about we go... here. Actually, let's explore around a little bit. Whoa, there's a box here. What could this be for? What? I hear... Oh, it's over here. Some of the messages that existed when I first came into being have vanished. Others have appeared. How many others like me have wandered these paths? How many thoughts have been lost? I'm still here. It seems we are all here at once, and not at all. Sorry, that's not very much help, is it? I can't think of any other way to put it. There... The sooner you accept that we will all be here forever, the sooner you will find enlightenment. What would this box be for? Simple principle. Though Stratton himself never used the term, his remark about the inescapable materiality of life, like, sorry, that like the bronze giant Talos, even the most faithful philosopher cannot live without his blood, ultimately became known as the Talos Principle. Oh, okay. So I have read it then. <laughs> what seemingly enraged many of his contemporaries and a significant number of later thinkers is the Principle's simplicity and unassailability, which, according to a fragment found in Miletus, cut through the rhetorical webs which sought to tangle the listener with fanciful words and thoughts of the heavens, like Alexander's sword through the golden knot. Diogenes Laertes makes mention of a dialogue by Anaximander of Chalcedon that expanded greatly on the Talos Principle, but that work remains lost. Officially began work on Archive today. Contributors from every country on Earth while network connections last. Team intimidated by Project Scope, but working hard. Will be sharing space with Drennan and Sarabhai team. Look forward to meeting them. This looks like a personal journey- journal. Oh, I just noticed that the bottom of the community monitor- I mean, sorry, the computer monitor here, it says Ian.
Spongebob comment. First, seriously, Cheese Man, that was the best you could say? A great snapshot of the human species at its best and at its worst. At its worst? Come on, it's just set a comment. I'm not Stalin. Stalin was also a troll commenter. Maybe you should cut out the jokes. This is serious. The most serious thing that's ever happened. I think that's a great reason to joke around. Internet's working less and less. Goodbye, all. Bye. God bless you. Last. Internet's working less and less? That's strange. Why is this archive text only? Like, what about all the other kind forms of communication? Like, videos? And interactive media? Maybe it's all corrupted? I don't know. Maybe because of the corruption it can only slightly show us text stuff, I guess. And again, these, uh, these are locally cached documents. Like, whatever server it's connected to, or failing to connect to, uh, it has all the corrupted data. Huh. What would I do with this box? Okay, I guess that works. Classical Philosophers. That LZ-19. An extensive collection of works by the ancient philosophers of Greece and Rome annotated. Compression algorithm LZ-19 not available in system. I thought that LZ-19 was a uh, compression format. Huh. I mean, like, not one that I've heard of, but it just sounds like it would be a compressed file. Uh, from Alexander Dan to Ian mailing list, subject progress report 3. Hi all, as per the last meeting, we're going with an existing game engine for the simulation. This gives us a whole slew of advantages. Stability, ease of use, modular, easy to integrate, large amount of pre-existing assets, inherently aimed at testing users, Designed for iterative processes. After some back and forth, we've decided to use the blank. I mean, sorry, the blah. All the relevant documents are attached. Yeah, so the, the robot we're playing as is in a simulation right now, I guess. In the in the game, per se. All right. Well, I guess we know what the box is for. What about in episode 0 when I had that, um, jammer with me? Could I have used it to get a star somewhere? Cause I looked around and I didn't see anything like that. Must have been really well hidden or something. Alright. Let's go to the next puzzle. Deception. this archway over and over again. This is one of the pre-made assets. Council... Uh-huh. Interesting. 
<laughs> okay, I guess I can't have them in the the same. Okay, I guess that makes sense. <laughs> oh, there's another one here. Is that why it's called Deception? Do I not need to use that gate at all? area here. Something tells me that's gonna be important. Oh. oh, okay, that's, yeah. That's really simple now. Oops. Deception, indeed. Yeah, so the trick is we don't need to use that at all.
Okay, looks like all we've got left is that over there. Mobile minefield. Minefield. That one's not moving, though. What's the point of that one? Okay. Oops. Oh, that's it then. Oh, that's the way out. Simple. I wonder why that was there. Anyway, we've gone way over time, so thanks for watching, and as always, if you hate the sound of my voice, leave a dislike, it's up to you, and I will see you all in the next episode. Goodbye!